Hello again, folks, and welcome back to Let's Play Only Mushatana Blades. I'm your host, the Game of Darius. We're just going to try to get onto that ship. But I'm going to try to go this way first and see if that does not lead us to the ship. Because if it doesn't lead us to the ship, there's going to be prizes. Oh, I hate you, Hell Spiders. Thank you. Okay, I gotta blow that up. Uh, looks like I got to discover another puzzle. Hmm. Kind of weird that those ones are all like. Oh, okay. Um, are, are we not gonna target the thing? Okay. I was about to ask. Were we gonna target it? I was worried there for a second because if we didn't target, I'd be slightly miffed. Ain't gonna lie, Roberto has suddenly become my utmost favorite when it comes to slaughtering things. I mean, come on. He's got a range punch attack. He range punches. Why are there so many save mirrors? It's kinda stupid. I mean, I know that I'm going to need to blow that one up over here, but I need to punch this one open anyways. You're telling me that a stick of dynamite is far stronger than his punches. Uh-uh. I don't believe. I don't think so. Alright, so two elephants. Bomb. Two elephants. Jumping on the bed. Oh god, my sir. Why are you letting elephants jump on the bed? Get up! Lame brain. Don't know why I always go to press R1 just as things are going to get bad. Alright. Uh. So it's going to only be three of the warehouses that have the numbers. Official's diary. Three bears, two elephants. Wait, this feels plot E now that I think about it. Yeah, this feels very plot E, so let me grab Ohatsu by getting the right character out, of course. Ohatsu! We need your OP laser. Okay. Okay. Um. Hmm. Target. Uh, how much damage did that do in the first place? Yeah, it does a sizable chunk. All right. So, hey, blue ore. That's right. I could have been grinding those guys for blue ore. Oh God. I'm gonna need to start writing this down. Writing this down. Two bears now. Uh. I'm guessing that those are swallows. Swallows! And there's five of them. Two. Bears. Right? Two bears? Three bears. I'm gonna have to go back into that room. But, two elephants. I could just put the Ellie part of elephants, but no. I decided to spell out the entirety of the word. Uh, okay. Keep on reminding myself I gotta play some more, um. Who's a Medusa does it? <laughs> I'm sorry, I just love how these guys just kind of fall down at first. Yeah. Come, Ohatsu. Let us discover the rest of this puzzle, assuming that there is more to this, there is more to this puzzle. Four doggies. Okay. Um, no other loot in here? No? Okay. Wait. I feel like one of these might be a trick. I say that only because... Like, you know how that first one that we had encountered was, uh, three numbers? I don't know if this other one's gonna be three numbers or not. 
All right, one whale. Whale! There we go. <laughs> Love how my uh, handwriting here is only slightly more chicken scratchy than it usually would be. That said, my handwriting is not usually very chicken scratchy. It is one of the things I am glad about when it comes to writing uh, com almost completely by hand when it comes to my evil DM journals. Alright, this is the bears. Three bears, I knew I had it wrong. Alright. And before we go opening this lock, I want to go back uh, the other way and check out those other two warehouses I had been next to. Seriously, it looks like a freaking vacuum pack, but it sounds like a proton pack from Ghostbusters. I mean, ghosts, Genma, same difference, I guess. Yeah. Turns out it was the Japanese that first developed the proton pack. Invention notes, awesome. Uh, one, two, three, four, five, six butterflies. Butter flies. Cool. I got butterflies. Now I need to see whether or not the log over here is actually six numbers long. It is three. Confusion has set in. I'm... Yeah, I'm gonna hit those, uh... Hit the save point. Go back to those other doors. Turns out that Soki is the only one who can probably save, huh? No, this is just a mirror that I can't save at. Alright, fine. I'll go check out those other doors and then... I'll go save. Wonder why the hell they even put it there, though. Like, don't get me wrong. I mean, I can just walk back here and check out what is in these things, right? Yeah. And I don't have to worry. Oh, I'm glad I did. In order to prevent theft, blah, blah, blah. From the left, there are six warehouses ordered one to six, each with pictures. Find the numbers hidden in those pictures. The result will be six pairs of numbers, a warehouse number, and its corresponding picture number. Reorder the pairs from smallest to largest based on the numbers in the pictures, then follow the picture number order. Take the th first three corresponding warehouse numbers to get the... What? Ugh. Fine. Okay. Warehouse number and its corresponding picture number. Already have the size of the animals and whatnot. Reorder the pairs from smallest to largest based on the numbers in the pictures. Okay, so whale. Oh, smallest to large. Bleh. So that would be the butterflies, swallow, dog, bear, elephant. Whale. Let's also put butt and bear instead of just bees. Alright, then following the picture number order, take the first three corresponding warehouse numbers to get the comp. So, is it 654? No, that wouldn't make sense. I'm just looking at this and going like, what the frick, Capcom? This is... This is easy. So yes, thank you. Shut up. Go ahead. That made no sense in my head. Does that make any sense to anyone else? Because it doesn't make sense to me. I'm not exactly the best when it comes to puzzles. I just like that aha moment from when I successfully figure one out. And I did save, so I got that going for me right now. Okay. From largest to smallest. Unless we're talking... So... Butterflies... 
But if I swallow... Yeah, but if I swallow dogs? I totally read how this thing works wrong, didn't I? Numbers are not in the right order. God damn it. Uh... Wait, so one whale... God damn it. I'm not sure how the hell that thing was red. Stupid puzzles, being no freaking stupid amounts of cryptic that I don't even understand. Alright. From the left there are six warehouses ordered one to six, each with pictures. Find the numbers hidden in those pictures. The result will be six pairs of numbers. Hate. So I gotta go back through each of those warehouses, number each of these one through six, and that's how we'll figure this shit out. Alright. What was this one? This one was the Swallows. Swallows was one. Unless I already did them in order when I had, uh, gone up and down the aisle. Come on. So warehouse two. Those were the dogs. Okay. Swallows five one. Dogs four two. <sighs> puzzles, man. Just puzzles. This is the whale, which was three. Next up is probably going to be bears. I'm going to say it was the bears next. And butterflies was the one behind the one that I bombed? Probably not. I love, however, that I can just pop... Hey, it was the bears. That I can just pop, an, uh, pop into these warehouses through the enemies that I should probably be killing every single time. But then again, I also ground uh, levels to all hell, so... I really don't need it. Butterflies were five. Which means that elephants was six. By process of elimination. Okay. So now... Wait. Oh, that one didn't count because that one was just Roberto's thing. Let's examine those notes again. That was weird. Alright. The results will be six pairs of numbers, a warehouse number's corresponding picture number. Reorder the pairs from smallest to largest based on the numbers in the pictures. Okay, so it was... Three... Well, smallest to largest would be five first, because butterflies. So it's butterflies, swallows, dogs. Then, following the picture number order, take the first three corresponding warehouse numbers to get the combination. So, wait. So... <sighs> so, it would be 5... 1, 2, right? I think one. How am I not doing this right? From smallest to largest, it would be butterflies. Oh, six. Yeah, it would be six. One. Why am I getting one? Smallest to largest would be butterflies, swallows, dogs. So six. Five four? No. Five two one. Five one two is what I'm getting here from this. Watch absolutely everyone be un mad at me for not understanding how this thing works. 
Warehouse number is corresponding picture number. Reorder the pairs from the smallest to largest based on the numbers in the pictures. Okay. Based on the numbers in the pictures would be whale, elephants, bears, which would be three, two, four. If we're talking about the corresponding warehouse numbers. <sighs> Three, two, four. Okay. Okay. Reorder the pairs from smallest to largest based on the numbers in the pictures. The numbers in the pictures practically correspond with the freaking animals with them, by the way, because one whale being the largest and whatnot. Based on the numbers in the pictures, so it would be from smallest to largest butterflies, swallows, dogs. Five, one, two. I'm looking it up. Screw this. Match the number of warehouses up with the animals and portraits in each of those warehouses. Reorder the animal numbers from least to greatest, which again would be one whale, two elephants, three bears, so on and so forth. The first three corresponding warehouse numbers would be three, six, four. I feel like that that was worded wrong somehow. Like, the the game versions was worded wrong. Because I don't know how the frick I had messed that up so many times. Ah well. We continue on. Hello, mister. You like lasers? You don't seem to like lasers very much. Hmm. Save point. Which means that whatever is beyond this door... Oh, 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 that door's gonna be locked. Bar from the other side. Can't force it. Can't even open that one. We'll say. Before anyone asks, no, I don't quite understand how the hell I was screwing that one up. <sighs> Wait. Did I already open that puzzle box? No, I did not. Huh. Open it up then. One puzzle to another. How? What? I don't. Okay. Oh. I'm gonna hate this. I'm already telling you guys I don't like this. Okay. Alright. Her. I already have severe problems with this thing. Right. Uh, that. Up. No. I'm not gonna get this, am I? Because I only got one more and I still need to line up the purple and the red there. That one. This one. This one. Okay. Cool. 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 I am too good sometimes. Sometimes. Not all the time. Barely any of the time, actually. Yeah, so let's grab this. Medicine. Alright. I'm gonna go ahead and save again because I'd rather not, uh screw that up again. There we go. Now come! Let us defeat whatever the hell is... Okay. 
Those things died fast. Actually, can I go to this one? No? I can't loot any more of your warehouses. I like the, the there's there's a key necessary. Where is there a key? Where was there a key? Legitimate question, where the hell did I not go that there was a key that I needed? Was there a challenge I had not gone to do? Was there someone's abilities that I had failed to use? Do I need to cross that bridge? Probably gonna cross that bridge. No, nah, let's try not crossing that bridge first. I mean, logically, wouldn't we just need to be able to jump off the side here? No, no. Too easy. Well, at least these things aren't that hard to deal with. In theory. Ow. My face. Actually, Don't know what that ability was, but hey, it worked. Wonder if I can just kill this guy at range. Maybe not that that far of a range. Hey, it does make the sound of hitting it though, so. I've even been pushing back just a little ways every single time that something dies. It's kind of funny. Right. Key. Who the hell has the key? This is, uh, this is the questions that we're currently asking, because I'm, I'm stopped by puzzles and keys at every other turn. D, give me a key. No? No key from you? I doubt that any of these guys are actually going to give me a key. Can't be that far from where the key was actually- where the key is needed. Where could I have possibly not gone though? Oh, there's two of you. That's disconcerting. Stop shooting my bullet for him. There we go. All right, let's get moving. Got it. Hmm. Was there something I missed in one of the warehouses? No. Pretty sure all that was in the warehouses was random items and shenanigans. Really? Really so key? God. <sighs> God damn it, Soki. Where the hell would there could have a been some place for me to find a key? Wait. Stubborn steel door. I'm an idiot. Silky, we must find our other companion. The one who is very apt at punching things. So damn good. Poor little Jube. Gets no loving. Although I think my rapport with her is currently the best. So we'll see. Don't mind me, just a giant moron. Key? Key. Uh, I feel like I should switch back to a Hatsu. If only because that laser is way OP. Nah. Nah, this is this is Philippe the Philippe, which is all about Roberto, so let's go with Roberto. This may end up bad. This may, may end up good. Can I enter any of these warehouses for any further loot? 
No loot. No loot. No loot. On to the Felipe. Is that it? No mistaking it. That's the San Felipe. The group has discovered the San Felipe lying in the port of the Forbidden City of Sakai. However, very powerful presence is drawing closer and closer. Oh, is it going to be Sakon? Hurry. I think something has caught our scent. Huh. Something very dangerous. Oh, really, Soki? Soki leaves the security of the ship to the, to the others and stands alone against the impending threat. Okay, so I didn't need to worry about Roberto. I was right! Actually, I wonder if I could purify him. I'll hold Sakon off. Secure the ship. Oh yeah, you, you do that, Soki. We'll just get right on purifying the bastards. Actually, I almost think that worked. And you know what? Only move shield. Oh, I ain't afraid of you, Mr. Sakon. Which is kind of saying something, because you are a big scary beast of a man. Even though you're probably filled with all the bugs. You, sir, probably don't get laid very often anymore, do ya? I'm gonna go with a yes. Come on. Alright, couple more blows. There we go. 1800 XP. Damn. Blue! Get on! It'll leave Hurry, without you! Hurry! Soki! <laughs> Soki! Ah. <laughs> Round two, mofo? Is that what we're doing here? He's going to destroy the ship! Stop! Tenkai! Is everyone all right? Forget about us. Tenkai, you're back. Yeah, he'll spat me back out. Spat you back out? It's not important now. Oh, right. It's time to expel the darkness. You just came back from the other side. Need a little help? Soki, show me the power of the Onimusha. Oh! <sighs> 
Was it just me, or did Tinkai never have the only Musha gauntlet on? It would appear they know about Shima Bara. It is all part of the plan. His plan. Ah, yes. He has not yet given up on the power of the Black Pony. It would appear so, anyway. Have you heard from Ophelia? She, she has already made preparations at Hizen. <laughs> Impetuous fools. I am sure she must be quite eager to greet her new guests. I, I am sure she will make them feel welcome. Rosencrantz. We must hurry to Shimabara and prepare for our friends. The Oni will have a nice surprise waiting for them. Understood. Uh, uh, what of Sakon? Leave him. He has failed for the last time. Too bad. He would have made a great subject for my research. <laughs> Still don't know what's up with Mr. Fancy Pants white dressed guy there, so gonna have to figure that out in the next episode now, won't we? Thank you all for watching. When we return wherever we're landing, uh, I know that it's um Kyushu? Something like that? Anyways, thank you all for watching. I'll see you guys in the next episode. Take care. Cheers.